Have you ever felt like you're more aware than others around you? Like you're wide awake, while everyone else seems to be in a deep sleep? Sometimes, you might even feel like there's a different person inside of you. These moments often pop up when you're starting to discover your special spiritual talents. It's pretty fascinating how some folks get these gifts when they're young, while others find them later in life. The reasons behind this difference can be really interesting. Maybe for some, certain life experiences are like pieces of a puzzle that need to come together before they fully wake up to these gifts. If you're spiritually gifted, your imagination is boundless. It's like a superpower that drives you towards creative stuff where your mind can go wild. You're amazing at creating whole new worlds and universes in your head and bringing them to life. When you meditate, it's like you're diving into unexplored parts of your mind, away from the everyday world. All this exploring makes your experiences richer and connects you more deeply to the spiritual side of things. Talking to someone who's also gifted can be a big help. They've got insights and wisdom that can help you understand why you might sense things others don't. Their advice can shine a light on how you see and understand the world, giving you a clearer path on your spiritual journey. Feeling what others feel comes naturally to spiritually gifted folks like you. You're super sensitive, and that lets you really understand and connect with the pain people go through, no matter how far away they are. Just knowing about someone's suffering can hit you hard. You're tuned in to feel and understand pain deeply, way beyond what most folks can grasp. This deep understanding pushes you to look for real, genuine connections and experiences that truly resonate with who you are. Your spiritual connection isn't just with people, it goes beyond that to animals too. They somehow sense something special about you. Even pets that usually get jumpy around strangers feel drawn to you. This bond you share with animals shows how everything in this world is connected. It's like your spiritual gifts bring you closer to all life on Earth. One amazing thing about you is how effortlessly you connect with people. Just your presence has this calming effect, especially when things get tough. People find comfort and strength around you. You naturally become a rock for them to lean on when they're going through a rough patch. Your empathy and understanding make you a real support system for those in need. Your gift makes you super tuned in to feelings, but it also means you might feel emotions extra strong, like they explode inside you. You're so aware of others' feelings and the energy around you that sometimes you react emotionally without any clear reason. It's important to figure out how to handle these intense emotions to keep your own balance. Learning to tell apart your feelings from others and finding good ways to deal with these strong emotions is key. When you embrace your special talents, you turn these emotional experiences into opportunities to learn and grow for yourself and for the people you meet along your journey. Doing everyday repetitive stuff might be tough for you because you're looking for more, like diving deep into your thoughts and feelings. Those same old tasks might make you feel empty and like you're not living your true purpose. Your craving for deep thoughts and spiritual things often leads you to search for more meaningful stuff that matches your special talents. Embracing who you really are can open up amazing chances where you can shine bright doing what you're best at. Also, you feel a strong connection with changes in the weather, unlike many others who might not notice as much. The reason for this connection isn't totally clear, but many think it's because of how connected you are to nature. Being spiritually gifted means you can feel the natural rhythms of the earth and the sky. Things like storms, changes in the air, or the moon's cycle feel deeper to you. These changes in weather might make you feel more emotional, give you ideas, or feel like a way nature is talking to you. It reminds you that you're part of the big picture of the universe, and there's lots to learn about this amazing connection. Your sensitivity doesn't just stop at emotions, it also includes handling criticism from others. Even when people don't mean any harm, their comments can hit you hard. It's not easy for you to brush off criticism because you're so understanding and perceptive. It's important to figure out which criticisms are helpful for you to grow and which ones are just negative. The ones that help you grow are like tools that make you even stronger as you move ahead in your spiritual journey. People who are spiritually gifted have a special connection with their dreams. It's like a door to another world for them. When they sleep, it's easy for them to visit different places in their dreams. Sometimes, these dreams give them hints about what might happen in the future. They might see things or events before they actually occur. These dreams are like a secret guidebook that helps them understand more about themselves and the world around them. 
Understanding and accepting these dream experiences can teach them a lot and help them figure out their purpose in life. Their dreams give them a way to explore the big questions about life and the universe. Some spiritually gifted people feel a strange kind of pressure between their eyebrows, known as the third eye. People think this might mean they have a special ability to connect with the spiritual world and have really good intuition. Doing certain spiritual activities is important for them to make the most of this special ability. By doing things like meditation, picturing things in your mind, and working with your energy, you can make your clairvoyant abilities stronger. When this special part of you wakes up, you might start seeing things more clearly, understand things better, and feel like you're connected to a spiritual world beyond what you can physically see. People who are spiritually gifted sometimes feel physical sensations in response to things that others can't see. It might feel like a tingle or a prickling sensation. This kind of feeling confirms that they're extra connected to the spiritual side of things. These sensations can happen when they're around spiritual stuff, get inner insights, or feel strong energy around them. Because you're extra sensitive to things that are invisible, you notice subtle energies that others might miss. These feelings are like signals that show moments when you're connecting spiritually or aligning with a different kind of world. Understanding and accepting these feelings can make your spiritual experiences richer and make your connection to the deeper parts of life even stronger. As someone who's spiritually gifted, you might have times when you feel absolutely sure about things. It's like a moment when you know something for sure and doubt just doesn't exist. These moments are like a quick glimpse of knowing everything, where your gut feelings and beliefs are rock solid. It feels like you've seen what's coming or tapped into a deeper wisdom that guides you without any mistakes. Trusting these feelings of knowing deep inside you is super important, as life gets tricky. Your gut feelings act like a compass, showing you the right way and helping you make choices that truly match who you are. When you trust and rely on this inner wisdom, it helps you grow a lot spiritually and understand yourself better. Life isn't just about what you get, it's also about what you give with your special talents. Giving to others can make your own abilities even stronger. Imagine it like this. A glass that's empty can only get things, but a glass that's already full can give to others. So, are you more like the empty glass or the full one? Maybe you're somewhere in between, with a lot to share but also a lot to learn. Sharing your thoughts below can help us all understand the different ways we all grow and help each other on this journey. Hope you enjoyed this. If you liked what we talked about, feel free to give it a thumbs up or share it. See you next time. Take care and lots of love.